In my last video, we have discussed about row store and column store. In this video, we will discuss the data compression. How SAP doing the data compression in S4 HANA. SAP using lot of techniques to compress the data. But we will see one of the example of the how SAP doing the data compression. So this is the standard example. I took from one of the book. So in this you can see we have one table where we can have n number of records. So some of the entries I am showing from that record and so you can see the 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 record number, last name, location and gender in this table is there. So you can see the, how the SAP is storing the data. First it will store all the string or text related data in a dictionary vector. So they represent each and every string in the form of a number. So you can see uh, here we are having the last name Brown, Brown, Doe, Doe, Smith. So Brown, Doe and Smith is unique value. So this unique value in the dictionary vector, it will give the a unique integer value to them. So you can see this is the dictionary vector. Same way for location also we have created one dictionary vector and for the gender also we have created one dictionary vector. which those values which are which are unique values for we have given some number to them instead instead of giving and processing the string we can easily process the number that is the reason we have assigned some number and we have created dictionary vector then in the form of the attribute vector we store the data in the database for example i am storing the data in the database and database uh, is a columnar form column column store data so how it will be stored instead of brown brown do do smith in the uh, in the database it will be stored like brown is having 7 so 7 7 8 8 and 9 like that it will be stored you can see here 7 7 8 8 and 9 same way the location data will be stored in it is called attribute vector we what we are storing in the database it is called the attribute vector and it is stored column by column in the form of the number instead of instead of using the string data it will convert in the invert it will convert in the uh, integer and then it will store so what is the advantage we can easily process the data if we are storing as a integer values second thing so you can see only the stored data will be this highlighted data this number position will be not stored only the female and male and this data will be stored and from the position where it got stored from the memory location it will be this position will be derived from there so only this data will be stored in the dictionary vector these two values and last name this these three values like that we have a number of values that will be stored in same way in the attribute vector only the seven seven eight eight nine like that it will be stored this is the one form of the compression this is the basic compression after after this also SAP do more compression uh, if the identical values are there and those kind of compression also doing this is the advanced form just to explain how the SAP uh, on the S4 HANA database the compression is doing. So what is the advantage of doing the compression? So first thing we need the lower space. So low in the memory uh, since we are using the RAM. So uh, RAM is a memory in memory area. We need the main memory. We need lesser amount of main memory to store the data. Second thing whenever we are processing the data we have to take the data from main memory and put into CPU. CPU is having the register and cases those kind of things which is faster than the RAM as well. So there we have to take those data and then we have to process in that time from putting data from the main memory to the CPU we, we, we if we have small amount of data compressed data it will be faster when we uh, do the transition one place to another place third thing if we are since we are storing the data in the form of the integer that is the reason we can do easily comparison and lot of calculation we can do Way much faster than if the data is stored in the form of the string. So this is the advantage of compression. In next video, we'll discuss about OLTP and OLAP. How this OLTP and OLAP work together in S4 HANA. Previously, it was uh, we were doing those OLTP and OLAP, th OLAP things separately. Please like this video and subscribe to this channel. Thank you and happy learning.